Hi, my name is Harun Janadi and this video is regarding the current coronavirus situation which has created a shortage of ventilator machines. And in light of this, engineers around the world are looking at alternate solutions. They are trying to produce a breathing apparatus that would take the load off the existing ventilators. Therefore, I came up with this video to showcase my own solution. It is regarding a machine that is very simple, can be easily made at home and can be made by a person with little to no knowledge of electronics or computer programming. This machine that I've designed requires only two components that are sourced from the outside. The rest of the components you can find at your own home. The two components required are an ambu bag or a bag valve mask as it's known in medical terms. The other is a Viper motor assembly that is found in every car. These are the only two components required. So let's look at how the machine works and then I'll explain the details. As you can see, it's a very simple design. I've used a lot of tape, so pardon me for that. It's just a proof of concept rather than a fully functional robust prototype. The motor, the gearbox, the crank and the connecting rod are all part of the motor wiper assembly. When you purchase the motor wiper assembly, you'll notice that it comes with a motor, a gearbox on top, a crank, a connecting rod, and two other addition link bars. We don't need them, we'll remove them. They're easy to pull apart. Here's the view of the motor assembly with the additional linkages removed. If we turn it around, you'll sometimes find that there are four wires and sometimes you find there are five. If you find that there are just four wires, then you'll have to manually attach a negative terminal wire. Normally, they are grounded to the body of the motor. Now, within these wires, these four wires, you'll find a wire that makes the motor turn slow. There would be another wire that makes the motor go fast. We are interested in the wire that makes it go slow. And there are the other two wires. And the purpose of them is to make uh, the motor return to the parking position we won't be using them. So just ignore the remaining three wires and pick the one that makes the motor turn slow. Here's the full design again. Pardon me for using a lot of tape. My local hardware store was closed because of the lockdown. For increasing the volume of air coming out of the ambu bag, just place a block here or a spacer here. Because of the gearbox, there's plenty of torque in this motor to compress the ambu bag. Of the two things I've added, one is this guide ring and one is this sleeve at the end of the rod. Just place them on the only piece of wood that I found lying around in my house. The power is coming from the main AC through that power supply, but you can also run it through a car battery. Just a couple more points. You can slow it down with a 12 volt rheostat if you want to. The other point is if you want to add intermittency to this machine, all you need to do is add a wiper relay to this circuit. Now fortunately the default stoppage time in all the car wiper relays is 5 seconds and this coincidentally matches with our rate of breath. We breathe at about 12 times a minute. So there we go that was my idea of producing the simplest design of an automated ambu bag. If you have any suggestions for improving this design further do add them in the comment section. Help spread the word. Thank you for your attention.